Now we will begin the very important step of laying out the TP tripod. First, look at your entire group of poles and separate out your four sturdiest poles and also your two smallest poles. Three of the four sturdiest poles will be used as your tripod poles. The remaining fourth pole will be used as your TP lift pole. The two smallest poles will be used as your two smoke flap poles. Our next step is to prepare the smoke flap poles. The smoke flap poles need to be two feet longer than the stated size of the teepee. For the 18 foot teepee that we will be putting up today, the smoke flap poles need to be 20 feet long. Measure them and cut them at this distance. The smoke flap poles are the smallest of the poles because they need to flex around the teepee to create tension on the smoke flap pockets. This helps keep the smoke flaps themselves taut and sturdy for their intended use to help guide the smoke out of the teepee. Be sure and smooth and round the end of the smoke flap poles themselves because they will sit in the smoke flap pockets. We don't want them to slowly abraze or tear the smoke flap pocket itself. Now you need to imagine exactly where you want to put your teepee. The door should always face east. It's helpful to run a line and stakes around the perimeter so you know your location as you set up your tripod. The green ring shows you exactly where we plan to set up the teepee. Now look at the ground plan and you will notice the three tripod poles, the door pole, the south pole, and the north pole. Look at their positions on the ground plan diagram. We will now lay in the three tripod poles. Now we will pick up the poles and walk them over to the site. It is easy to carry a pole vertically. We will now place the south pole and the north pole on the ground plan as you've seen in the diagram. The south pole and north pole lay side by side. The door pole will be placed, as you see on the ground plan diagram, right beside the left hand point of the door hole. This is an approximation at this point, but do your best to locate that point. The door pole crosses the north and south pole. Now, look at the diagram for your distances and your layout, and also in the Nomadics TP setup book. We will now find the exact distances for the south pole, north pole, and door pole, and tie them together as a tripod. Measure the distance of the south pole and north pole according to the measurement diagram. This distance is the point where the door pole will cross the north pole and the south pole. Mark your poles so you'll know these positions as you continue tying your tripod poles together. Measure your door pole to the correct length also. See the measure measurement diagram for these distances. Now cross the door pole across the two north and south poles so that the three marks line up exactly. This is very important and now you've established the exact length for these three poles and the tripod will fit your teepee perfectly. 